current public health orders as we have them, which were set to expire on April the, the 5th, are going to be extended until April the 12th. We all need to be very diligent in following these public health orders as they are put forward so that we can continue to drive our case numbers down without increasing, increasing our restrictions further in our community or extending the already increased restrictions that we have in the community of Regina. This is very important for all of us to be very diligent. I support the mayor of Muzha who has said that, you know, behave as if you're in Regina, minimize your number of contacts, order more takeout, more curbside pickup, be very cautious about any household bu uh, 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 bubbles and very cautious about any indoor gathering. So I think Muzha is on red alert and, we, and this uh, has to be watched very closely. People in Muzha should really uh, look at the Regina order and guidelines and, and try to emulate that. But, you know, like the Premier said, you know, if, if the concern continues in Muzha, you know, further restrictions will unfortunately have to be applied. And, and similarly for other communities in the south of Saskatchewan. Thank you. The way through this is vaccines. The way through this is not to increase public health measures. We have significant public health measures in place. We're asking people to be uh, extra diligent and over the course of the next number of weeks as we find our way through the, the dying weeks, uh, what we hope are the dying weeks of this, of this pandemic, until we can provide them with access to a vaccine.